Fridays are always fun around here because we get to meet a new friend from Helping Hands Humane Society. Today is no exception. Emmy has a very tall young man with her. <laughs> yes, he oh, is good. a big boy. Sick, good good guy. Job. Who do you have today? Emmy? His name is Ace. He's one of our longer term residents. He's been at the shelter 85 days now. He's about two years old. We think a lab Aussie mix. And he's being a little shy in the studio right now, but he loves treats. He knows some tricks. He likes to play with the ball, so he'll get more outgoing when he's comfortable. He's doing a very, very good set. Yeah. What did you say you call him? Ace. Ace, come here, honey. Yeah. Ace. Let's see if I can hold on to oh, you. Here go. Do we know anything about Ace's background and how Ace came in? Yeah, so um, his previous owners unfortunately weren't able to keep him any longer. So he has been with a family before. He already knows some obedience training. Once he gets comfortable with you, he is a lot more outgoing and he'll be a little bit more cuddly as well. Ace is currently trying to play on the computer, <laughs> but that's okay. Um, obviously, he's a little skinny, so we'd love for him to put on some weight. We think that he will, his stress. Uh, level will lower once he's in a home with a family and then hopefully he'll be able to put on weight become more comfortable he really is a really smart and pretty gentle guy he is what yeah. do you have going on with dogs right now because you still have a lot of dogs in the shelter yeah we've just had an influx of a lot of dogs coming in so our kennels have filled and we're doing an emergency dog adoption special it's name your price so every dog and puppy every single one there's no exceptions are as low as twenty dollars to adopt you get to name your price. So you can pick $20, you can pick $50, however much you're able to give and you want to give to help the shelter. We just want to get dogs out and it's been working. We've had a couple of really good adoption days. Awesome. Yeah. You, cats aren't left out of the fun either. You yeah. do have, you said, a very popular activity, cat yoga. Can yes. we still take advantage of that? Absolutely. So tomorrow we have a cat yoga class at 1.30 p.m. You're going to have to jump on our Facebook page and look at the event to see if there are any tickets left. I know it was getting close to selling out, but we do that class very regularly. So if you miss it this time, just watch for the next one. One. There also is a lot of planning going on right now. I've been seeing some initial <laughs> save the date cards yes. for Paws in the Park. Yes. You're planning a big celebration again. Absolutely. So that's always at the end of April. Um, it's a really fun event. It's our biggest event. The most people come to it and you can bring your dog and it's just going to be a lot of fun. Vendors, activities, a great way to support the shelter. We're going to have really cute shirts. So watch for the shirt design that we'll be releasing. Um, but yeah, we'll have more and more information about that coming soon. For those who can't adopt right now, I mean, how else can they support the shelter and support the homeless animals? There's so many ways if you could temporarily have an animal in your home you could foster but we understand if you can't you could still volunteer donate just share the post and we have new adoptable pets talk to your friends and family about what you know great work we do and that we're a great place to get a new pet any of those really really help well ace is certainly a lovable one yeah. and again it's the name your price adoption special yes um, and if people didn't hear when we broke the news last week your community clinic now yes. is doing low, low cost vaccinations by appointment Monday through Friday. You don't have to wait for a special once a month event. Exactly. Any day of the week, hop on our website. There's a really easy online thing you can fill out if you need some kind of vaccination for your pet. Um, so we want to make it as easy as possible and get as many pets in our community vaccinated as we can. By the way, Ace has that super cute shorter tail. Yeah. We don't know don't what happened, that. but it looks super cute on you, Ace, <laughs> which is just perfect for you. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you, Ace, for being with us to meet us today on Ion Northeast Kansas. And thanks to all of you for being along as well. Remember, hhhstopeka.org is how you can find out the shelter's wish list. You can also view all their latest announcements on their Facebook page. And yep. thank you for being with us to meet Ace as he checks out the computer one more time. And we'll see you back here in a half hour for Live at Five. Thanks, big guy.